Hello, I hope all is well. So I've been working for quite some time on building up a combat alt. I got 75 Slayer and I really wanted to start alting Gargoyles to see how much money I could make and just see uh, how viable it still was as an alt today. I know things aren't worth as much as they used to. Things like Gold Ore, Myth Bars, and Steel Bars are definitely worth a lot less. But I still think this is pretty valuable to do because it is really low attention while playing on a main. So... I've seen a lot of people do like 1,000 or 10,000 gargoyle kills or loot from 10 hours, but I don't think I've ever really seen anyone do loot from one Guthan set, so that's what I have. I'm trying to see how many kills I can get on one Guthan set. There is one inventory. I managed to stay for over 700 kills, and really the only thing you're going to have to bank for is the Runite Ores, depending on how many of those you get. You can Alk the Mystic Tops, but I kind of wanted to collect those along with the Granite Mauls. Everything else is either Alkable and stack or Stackable. And they have some really nice Alks, like a Rune Legs and a Rune 2H Swords that are really have some solid value. And the Stackable Drops, as well as the Cash Drops, really add up. So definitely a Ring of Wealth is helpful uh, when you're an alt up here, not having to pick up all those coin drops. They do sometimes drop 10,000 coins at a time. So there's my gear setup. Very newbie, very bot looking. Uh, definitely not a bot at all, but I uh, didn't bother with any quests on this account, so I'm using the combat bracelet. I've got that ring of wealth and the uh, D boots with the obsidian cape. All right, here we are a few hours later, and the chain skirt and the body have both broken. The helmet is on the verge of breaking, and the spear actually has a lot left. That's because I was able to spend most of the time using the whip and the dragon defender. This account is fairly low level for having 75 Slayer, but even with these stats, I found that I was able to really leave this account almost completely alone and while I was focusing on main main. I was sometimes questing or even doing Vorkath, and... There I am with 1,306 kills, and that is 15 hours of combat for that body and chain skirt to fully degrade. So I spent 15 hours total up there over the course of two trips. I did, since I didn't have to take food and everything stacked, I just took uh, like eight super combat potions with me, and I would stay for 800 kills or so, 700 kills until I filled up on Runite Ore, and so I only banked once during the making of this video up uh, prior to the end. So I'm going to go ahead and add in all the drops from my first trip. I got rid of all the cash out of this bank before I started just to make sure uh, that it wouldn't mix. I think I actually put a 2 mil up offer for a Twisted Bow, so really hoping that buys, but I won't hold my breath. So in the making of this video, I came away with 550k combat experience along with about 180k hit points experience. So that's about 37k combat experience per hour, so not nearly as good as AFKing in the Nightmare Zone, but as far as low attention training goes, this wasn't terrible because of the money that we made, and I'm actually going to go ahead and look and see about how much I did make. As far as supplies, the only real supplies were the super combat potions and then the cost of the degrading Guthans, and since my main does have 99 smithing, it is really a lot cheaper for me to repair it, so once it's broken, I can just trade it over to my main and repair it there. So I did make uh, 500 or 5 mil, about 5.1 mil, with about 250k or so in supplies. So that's about a 4.9 mil profit over the 15 hours. So that's somewhere around 300k per hour. So not a fantastic money maker, not as good as it used to be, but considering it's extremely low effort, it does provide some training. It's not bad. I think I'm glad I did this. I don't think I'm just going to keep this as solely a gargoyle alt. I want to maybe build up to something better long term, but I definitely recommend if you are playing and you have a, a spare account that's around these stats, letting them sit at gargoyles isn't a bad idea. You will get some experience and make some money. Alright, that's all for this video. Thanks for watching. I hope you found it interesting, and I'll see you in the next one.